but I want you to just say, look, this is what happened. This is what we're doing. And this is what the future looks like. Sure. I believe what you're, what you're asking and to be specific for those that maybe aren't familiar is that there was a court case against the Aussie family, uh, Midamar Corporation, the ISA back in uh, 2014, 2016. So to understand what happened and to truly give it uh, a, another perspective to which up until this time on a public level, it's been very limited. Yeah. You have to go back to the beginning of why would an organization or what happened over the course of from February of 2010, when our first inclination that there was an issue that came up until uh, mid 2016 when it ended. So you're talking about a six year period of time here and trying to then condense that into an explanation that will leave the listeners with a better understanding. It may not give a full grasp, but at least give some understanding. But more important is what have we learned from it? Brother Jalal, I, I wanted to come in here. One very, very important point you made was that the case was not involving the misrepresentation of non-halal as halal. Correct. And it, it didn't uh, put anybody's life in danger. But it, uh, I'm, I, and I'm talking about food safety. So there was no food yeah. safety issue involved. There was no non-halal issue that was, or non-halal meat that was sold to Muslims as halal. Because from from Muslims, uh, from the uh, Muslim consumer point of view, they want assurance that nothing of that sort happened. Can you just be 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 be, be emphatic and say yes, that is what I meant? Because that is what I heard you say. Is that what you really meant? Yeah. So so the main issue again had to do with beef that was approved for export from one facility yeah beef that was not approved for export from another facility both facilities performed halal slaughter but the approval so in the us we have plant by plant approval so the approval for plant a was such but plant b for example was not approved and so the meat from plant b was marked as from plant a because so it could go over there but the beef was halal from the beginning that was never contested 